Good evening everyone, my name is Nicholas, I'm the part time thrifter, I buy us online and I'm just in for profit. So, uh, we are at 1,430 subscribers, which is brilliant, and what we've got is we've got another NBA Top Shop pack opening. Um, actually, I've also got the first time that I've actually made money straight away as the pack was actually dropping, and uh, I'm actually straight away going to make sure that I screen record it for you, and you can actually see what I'm referring to uh, as I'm actually talking about it. So if you give me one minute, you actually can see here, okay, uh, is first of all my NBA Top Shop account. You can actually see that we did purchase a pack uh, for $9 and I've synced it to the 4G this time. So hopefully it should be actually a lot faster for you guys. I did purchase a pack for $9, but the big one for me is this. Uh, you can actually see how I bought, I bought Clean Capella for 8 quid and I sold them for 25 Now I imagine he's potentially might have actually risen to even more. So let's have a quick look. In regards to how much Clint Capella is actually worth at this moment in time, uh, it's available from 1,838 1, even. Sorry, and um, why, why did I buy it? Why did I sell them? Okay, so I've realized that every time that a new pack is actually dropping, uh, is they seem to be actually dropping the challenges too. So you can actually see 26 quid. I didn't do too bad considering that I bought it and 10 minutes after I actually sold them. And he is part of um, a challenge, okay? So if I go to my challenges, complete a challenge, he's part of the Cool Cat Challenge. So really I suggest guys, when a Cool Cat, cool cat Challenge or whatever challenge actually pops up, see if you can actually buy at least one of these uh, and get your money back really for it. So I've got Clint Capella, uh, I bought them for eight quid and sold them for 25 and uh, I think that was amazing. I think at the moment in time, uh, yesterday when I was looking, so today what is it's half three. Uh, when I was actually looking uh, at these, um, Terence Ross was actually the most expensive one. It was going up to twenty five, right? So it's going up to thirty seven, and um, yeah, they've all actually gone crazy price. I think also Bam was actually quite a big one, forty four quid. Um, Johnson might be. Let's have a look. DeAndre Jordan, I think he was the cheapest one. John Collins was a bit higher up. Did you see DeAndre Jordan? So DeAndre Jordan was worth... He's worth 38 quid. So again, it's not too bad really for us. And uh, obviously, I was able to get the pack. You had to pre-register for this pack. It was a bit of a different scenario here for us. And you can actually, if I go to my packs... You can find it there. But yeah, it was a bit of a different. You had to pre-register two days in advance that you wanted to actually buy a pack. And then you just joined the queue. And you joined the queue at any time between 30 hours. And last night I joined, it was 150,000 people in front of me. This morning I joined, it was only eight people in front of me. So I was able to buy one straight away. Um, so without further ado, let's actually open this pack. Uh, what I'm hoping for, I'm hoping for Lamelo, <laughs> or I'm actually hoping to get one of the people in the challenge, okay? Because uh, obviously this is a free pack because we did make sure that we sent clean, uh, we sold Clean Capella. Um, so let's have a look. It should be all common moments here, okay? I shouldn't be getting anything crazy. Uh, but we're looking for a low serial number or we're looking for something that's actually part of the competition. So we'll start right to left. First one, Cavaliers, Isaac Okoro, and quite a high uh, serial number. Let's have a look if you please. Not a bad dunk actually. Continuing. Again, he's got two badges on him. A dunk, Kendrick Nunn. They actually lost Miami Heat, so that's obviously not the not as good, really. Uh, seem to be the moment. Seem to have more value if the team actually wins too at that time. Not a bad moment. High serial number again, sixteen thousand. Right, let's see this one. The Deers Young is a dunk. Again, another loss. Uh, again, a medium serial number, really. Let's 
So the best one, the notable pool, let's see what they actually say, it's a notable pool. They're probably thinking they're all that bad. Uh, Nothing's going to be. So the day's young is actually notable pool because obviously it is the lowest ranking for us. Uh, but I'm actually, what I'm going to be doing today, I'm actually going to remove all my 35,000 uh, CC moments in circulation. I'm actually going to take them off the market marketplace because I'm... There's no point in okay, the marketplace now, I might get five, I might get six quid. I'm going to remove them in the marketplace because I think they're pushing these challenges more and more. Uh, so I do think that these moments are going to start to be worth more and more each time, really, for us. Uh, let's have a look what Emmanuel quickly is actually worth. Remember, he was actually up to 4,000 at some point, and he's been down to 200. Let's have a look what he's actually looking at this moment in time, uh, the different listings for him. Because obviously he is a five star rookie, um, and it's one of his first. Obviously, it's his first one was again two thirty, uh, which is crazy uh, for that. Uh, it's limited to four thousand. I'm going to start actually. I know it's going crazy, but I'm actually going to start buying moments. Okay, uh, I'm, I think I'm going to go at the ten k mark uh, limited uh, orders. So some of them you can buy them for 10, 15 quid, and. Obviously, I am getting my 20 quid free uh, from Top Shot uh, next week when the competition actually uh, finishes with a showcase. All you've got to do is really uh, represent a showcase with uh, basically NBA players that actually are on Top Shot. And I'll tell you exactly which players you can have. Like, Clint Capella was actually one of them you can actually have at the time. Uh, he was going for six quid, and I just liked. Uh, the way it looked to be gone at uh, the moment, so I was going to buy it previously, but I think it is worth investing in this. Um, I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying the journey. Okay, it's still making money out of it, which is brilliant. And uh, yeah, that's it really for us. Uh, hope you enjoyed another pack opening. I know uh, not a lot of people in the channel seem to actually be liking this, but I'm happy that I'm part of this NFT journey. So thanks so much for watching, everyone. And as always, keep thrifting.